Yeah, so there's recent results really highlight what we suspected was there, is that there's something bigger sitting at depth driving this mineral system below, and, and you know, it's, it's evidenced by what we're seeing on the surface in the, in the geochemistry and the drilling that was completed uh, early last year. So this really highlights what we're seeing is from a, a shallow perspective, you know, the first couple of kilometres of, of what the bigger system actually is. The top of the, the geophysical server really highlights the conceptual model we're working on is that there's these smaller porphyry plumes coming off a larger source that are driving these systems which you know has driven the mineralization that we're seeing at Echicola and really you know speaks to what we're seeing underneath this Antikilka target with what we're seeing on the surface and the architecture we're seeing about how it's formed so I mean this conceptual model was developed a few years ago by the project manager about what he was seeing on the ground and it's really come to fruition about you know, proving what we're seeing there. Yeah, so the previous work been done was not really put in context until we sort of got the survey completed. So now we've got these results, it really speaks to what the larger picture actually looks like. We're looking for big things and, you know, the way they respond is, is very different to the smaller scale. So what we've actually seen on the ground does actually make a lot more sense in terms of the, the regional context of what we're seeing in terms of a, a larger porphyry system at work and where to actually target it moving forward. That's right, so it was a, a multifaceted approach to what we were trying to achieve there. So we've done the groundwork for the AMT survey. So that'll give us architecture down to around 10 to 12 kilometers, um, some resolution about what's feeding this, this porphyry thing we're seeing in the magnetics. Uh, we've also got geochronology, which will help sort of put it in a, a date range to see what age the mineralization is, as well as extended geochemistry over the wider area. Um, and obviously we'll continue mapping this uh, Antikilka target, which is you know, proving everything we're seeing on the ground is supporting the bigger picture of there's a porphyry system at work. So lots of news flow and, and as we develop out the, the news, news flow on this target to refine it even further. Mm -hmm.